here to welcome you to the 2006 year at Hillary Ford Banquet. I would like to call your attention to the many guests who have accepted our invitation to join us this afternoon and thereby add so much to the importance of this occasion. Kindly hold your applause until I have completed all acknowledgments. We are pleased to have with us today the following members of the Board of Education President, Mr. and Mrs. Douglas Crombley, Mr. and Mrs. Jack Campbell, Stanley and Mindy Warren, Gary and Beverly Canning. Mr. and Mrs. Joey Barron, Mr. and Mrs. Ronald Tomo, and Mr. and Mrs. Michael Carter. Also, the members of the school administration who have joined us are High School Principal Mr. John Copenhauer, Assistant High School Principal Mrs. Pamela Ross, and Athletic Director Mr. John Robinson. The following members of our coaching staff are present. Mrs. Kim Burnell, Mr. Daniel Bushy, Mr. Joe Copley, Ms. Krista Dupree, Mr. William Durham, Mrs. Sarah Emanuele, Mr. Pete Kowalowski, Mr. Dennis LaBarge, Mr. Jamie LaBarge, Mrs. Leslie LaBarge, Mr. Dennis LaBear, Mr. Toby LaFlair, Mr. Don McNeil, Mr. Jared Gray, Mr. John Rodu, Mr. Mike Gregor, Mr. Larry Gross, and Mr. Wayne Harris. We are also pleased to have many of our guests, wives, and husbands present. appreciation to all our guests who have joined us this afternoon. At this time, it is my pleasure to introduce our athletic director, Mr. John Hurd. Thank you very much, Josh. It is my pleasure to welcome you to our annual athletic awards banquet. I would like to thank our coaching staff and student athletes for all your efforts as representatives of Northern Adirondack Central. I am especially grateful to our Board of Education Mr. Scott and Mr. Kokenauer, who continue to support athletics and make it possible for us to run a top-notch program. My special thanks go to Darla Bilo, who is invaluable to us in the day-to-day -day operation of our program. I would like to congratulate our teams awarded New York State Public High School Athletic Association Scholar Athlete Team status. Girls Soccer, Girls Volleyball, Girls Tennis, and Girls Softball. The following individuals were recognized as CBAC All Academic. Elizabeth Fivison and Nick Trombley for the fall, Courtney Bilo and Josh McNeil for the winter, and Danielle Pupor and Scott Matthews for the spring. I would like to thank our seniors for their leadership and wish them best of luck in all their future endeavors. We owe a special debt of gratitude to our girls volleyball and girls softball teams and Justin Perry, who were our only sectional champions. Our underclassmen, especially on the boys' side, need to step up and meet the challenge that the CBAC and Section 7 have thrown at us. Are we willing to settle for second or third best, or will we redouble our efforts through practice, off-season conditioning, and healthy lifestyles to be the best? Sometimes it is easier to get to the top than it is to stay there. We must not be complacent. We must not slide downhill. Don't settle for anything less than the best for yourself and for your teammates. I applaud you all for successfully completing an athletic season or seasons and trust you will demand excellence of yourself and your teammates for the 2006-2007 Interscholastic Athletic Year. Thank you. The modified girls soccer team coached by Dan Sheehan. The girls come forward please. Team 
will develop and be a force to contend with in the upcoming seasons. Thank you very much. Girls, as I call your name, would you come across and, and pick up your award from Mr. Revenue, please? Please hold your applause until we get done with the whole team. Brooke Burnell. Katie Hemingway. Allison Hall. Brittany LaPointe. Ashley Lord. Paige Magoo, Mary Manor, Kara Perry, Michelle Silver, Abby Spinner, Chelsea Trombley, Kirsty Bouvier, Hannah Brassett, Trulina Cameron, Brittany Sharon, Bethany Brown, Alicia Hero, Courtney Lambert, Brittany McDonald, Shauna Perry, and Taylor Wood. My girls soccer. Did the JV girls soccer team come forward, please? Ms. Marie Bogos and Ms. Ms. Krista Dupre.
That drum lead. Chelsea Barkham. <coughs> Tia Hicks. Emily Lajman. <laughs> Natasha Wilson. Kristen Burnett. Jill Gardner. Kelsey Torba. Heather Byron. Hillary Bowie. <coughs> Kaylin Scott. Brittany Barron. Jen Ryan. Girls Game Sock. <laughs> the girls varsity soccer players please come forward. The girls soccer team was coached by Mr. Jared Freya. Take up a little bit of the extra time that Ms. Dupre didn't take up this year, uh, and I apologize for that ahead of time. I would like to start by thanking the JV players and coaches for, for their hard work this season. I'd also like to thank the JV coaches for taking all the heat on the long run thing. My girls would come to me and say, whose idea is this stupid long run anyway? But they uh, JV coaches, sorry guys. Uh, they take the heat for that. Thanks guys. The team enjoyed another very successful season, finished with a record of 10-8-2, including 7-2-2 two two over the last 11. The girls learned the hard way early on the importance of playing all the way to the buzzer when we were beaten by a goal with one second left in overtime by NCCS. Over the course of the season, we post very, posted very key wins over PHS and Saranac Lake, both Class B finalists. The girls also gave me my first trip to a sectional final. Thank you, ladies. Offensively, we were led by Kayla Rabideau with 15 goals, Sarah Trudeau with five, and Stacey Siskavis with three. Courtney Bile also provided us with, with some very key offensive plays, including the game tying goal against Doc Sable and the game winning assist against PHS. Liz Fiveson made the switch to midfield, worked her butt off all year. Greatly appreciated Liz the job. Defensively, the team was anchored by Division II Honorable Mention Bart Wolf and Division II All Star Lane Cross. <coughs> Finally, Kayla Supley took on the, the, the task of marking the other team's best offensive player. Not an easy task with the talent in the CBAC. She did an outstanding job. The team also earned New York State Scholar Athlete Team Award. <coughs> Had a great season this year, ladies. Thank you very much. Uh, good luck, seniors and Kayleen, and everything you do in the future. Thank you. Varsity girls, soccer players. Kayla Rabbit. Sarah Trudeau. <laughs> Chelsea Barco. <laughs> Emily Ladger. Caleb Scott.
Kristen Burnett. <laughs> Stacy Harper. Kayleen Ryan. Heidi Rio. Kayla Soup. Amanda Torp. Kristen Watts. Stacy Saskatchewan. Justine Barkham. Lauren Carter. Victoria DeMore. Aaron Hemming. Stephanie O'Neill. Ashley Purry. Heather Taylor, Alyssa Barrett, Barbara Wolf, Courtney Byron, Elizabeth Fiveson. Elena Cross, and manager Megan Levesque. Joshua Powers. Zachary Torben.
Stephen Trudeau. Alex Barron. Stephen Whitwood. Cody Burnett. Ryan Bushy. Tyler Campbell. Ben Lavelle. Nick Lavelle. TJ Lavelle. Tyler Pombriel. And scorekeeper Viola Day. Modified boys soccer team. Would the JV boys soccer players come forward, please? The JV boys were coached by Mr. Peter Kowalski. JV soccer was a season of inexperience and improvement. The young Bobcats went through the season without a victory or a tie. Several games did go into overtime though, and were separated only by a goal. Even though we could not find a win in our first column, we improved throughout the season and showed a good amount of heart at times. The highlights are improvements. Saranac beat us 9-0 on the first meeting. 4-0 on the second, and only 2-0 on the third. <coughs> After losing the Potsford, at Potsford, 7-0, we were playing at home and playing as intense as we could play. We were leading 2-1 at the half, and I believe they were a little bit afraid that they were going to lose. Unfortunately, we came back to win 4-2, but we won in the respect column a big victory after that game. In terms of gaining confidence, earning respect, and improvement, our JV Boys Soccer Team was a success. Gentlemen, you need to take the following message to heart. You need to start tomorrow to prepare yourself for next week. You all need to stop whining, stop making excuses, get out of your butts, and do some old-fashioned, gut-wrenching, muscle-building, sweat-pouring workouts. If you come back this fall in the same sad shape you came in last fall, you can't expect to be much better, and you will be very, very sorry after the first couple of practices. Challenge yourselves. Thank you. <laughs> the JD Boys Soccer Coach, Andrew Manning. Rusty Finlayson. Peter Patterson. Anthony Parra. Josh Lazio. John Luke 410. Johnny Rook. Tyler Drake. Shane Kleinman. Anthony Carden. Zach Berg. 
Forrest Ryan, Tom Page. Adam Manuel. <coughs> Jacob Grogan. Alan Brassett. <coughs> Cody Trombley. The manager, Patrick Lefay. J.D. Boy Soccer Team. The boys varsity soccer players, please come forward. The boys varsity was coached by Mr. Jerry Hamlin. Justin Perry. Chance St. Germain. Doug Alexander. Brandon LeBuffer. Derek Jubert. James Burnell. Zachary Lajlin, Matthew Kent, Dylan Lajlin, John Hicks, Mitchell Roth, Tyler Brassett, Benjamin Fives. Jared Tatro, scorekeeper, Misty LaPointe, timekeeper, Heidi LaPointe. The boys varsity soccer team. With the modified volleyball team, please come forward by Miss Jamie Myers. Jamie couldn't be with us uh, this afternoon, and most of our modified volleyball team couldn't be with us by the law. <laughs> Jamie, Jamie writes, ladies, I'm sorry that I could not be here today. You all made my first coaching experience one that I will never forget. We had fun together and learned together. Each and every one of you improved so much throughout the season. I am very proud of you. 
Thanks for your time and dedication to the team. Good luck to those who are moving on to JV. You will be missed. And hope to see the rest of you ready to play next season. <coughs> oh, by the way, practice your chicken dance as well. <laughs> Thanks for the laughs, Coach Jamie. <laughs> Modified volleyball players, Amber Kay, Kayla Cook. Jordan Den. Courtney Lambert. Paige Magoo. Brittany McDonald. Laura Patton. Para Para, Desiree Potter, Megan Poopos. <laughs> Modified volleyball team. <laughs> the JV volleyball team has come forward. The volleyball team was coached by Mr. Cooper <laughs>
exceptional person, the tennis team. Being about my first year in this area and in this school, it made me get more into the school population. One day, to my surprise, this same person told me that they were looking for a varsity volleyball coach while I was walking down to Mrs. Island to get some coffee. Uh, at first, I thought he was joking, as always, but then in another classroom, two girls came in and started talking about the same thing. I knew these two girls from tennis, and I felt something inside that told me to be champions. With no further thought, I said to them, hey, I think it's Their faces lit up, but no further they ran out. They disappeared, and it was that way that I came to meet me, me, Mr. Rad. He told me about the responsibilities he took to coach at a varsity level, Team. At a varsity level, the most important thing is to give them strength and, you, and the encouragement to feel the best of them, to show them that you always have faith on them and to polish their skills they already know. I learned a lot this year from these two I learned what it meant to want something so bad and make you not sure. I learned that dedication really meant and what it felt to be part of the most inspiring and strong team I've ever met. They challenge themselves every day, and they never put themselves down. Their strength was so powerful that it got us to be the strongest team and practice with the weakest. They never underestimated themselves, as I never underestimated the will and power they were capable of achieving. To the six girls I lose this season, may you keep the strength and always remember who you are and where you stand in my heart. To the girls that stay, let's keep you going because you are the future and the author of this school's history in volleyball history. Thank you for trusting me and giving me the chance to be part of this wonderful thing. Love you always, and may you always be successful in everything you put your heart and soul to. To my team that won, first place, Saranac Tournament, third place, Canadian Tournament, Class 7, Sectional Champ, second place, Regional, to the varsity volleyball team of 2005-2006. I found that to my reigning team. In addition to receiving their letters, the volleyball team will be presented a championship plaque that states Varsity Volleyball 2005-2006, Section 7, Class C Champion. Varsity volleyball team, Elena Karofsky. Heather Taylor. <coughs> Alyssa Barron. Elizabeth Fiveson. Amanda Wells. Heidi Rio. Kayleen Ryan. Hillary Bowie. Amanda Byron. Heather Byron. Allie Green. Kristen Relation. Sarah Trudeau. And her friend. Scorekeeper <laughs> Nikki Trudeau. Bobcat Varsity Volleyball Team. Would the modified wrestling please come forward? The modified wrestling is coached by Mr. Jared Bree. Can the JV wrestlers please come up to the wrestle JV? Would you come up to the stage, too, please?
Kobe and I like to work as a team, so you know, we keep the team model going up here. We try to do this thing together. Maybe we'll be at it a little faster too. Modified engagement wrestling teams made great strides this season. On the modified, Chris Garso posted more than 20 wins. Mike Riley won two tournaments, and Dustin Snide showed great individual improvement with one arm. The JV was very inexperienced, with only with five of the eight wrestlers that never having seen JV action before. Guys worked uh, hard every day. Dustin Gadway, Chad Lombard, Harold Parent enjoyed great individual success. I want to sort of repeat what Mr. K was saying up here earlier. The only way you guys are going to improve is hard work in the off season. Go to camp, work hard this summer, maybe do a little running, and you'll come back that much better. Thanks, guys. Modified and JV wrestlers. Chris Garza. Kelby Gregory. Michael Riley. Jeff Ryan. Dustin Snod. Kyle Bushy. Kyle Patnell. Dustin Gavin. Chad LaBomba. Adam Lord. Harold Perrin. Patrick Mann. Corey Dubray. Nathan Bumbar. Stephen Boris. Zach Burke. Modified and JV wrestling.
may be inspired by your past success and motivate, motivated by your future challenges. I also want to thank you for allowing me to be part of your lives and, and, excuse me, and the lives of your brothers, uncles, yes, even your father. I gotta get out of town before the grandchildren start coming. <laughs> I could not have chosen a finer group of young men to finish my career. You, all, you will always be a part of my life. So I, so I doubt that I have strayed too far from the man. So, um, from, from, uh, for, for this year, I want to make sure that people join us at the <coughs> summer camp, put a lot of work in, so we're ready for another year. Thank you very much. Justin Perry is our sexual champ in wrestling, and he will receive a plaque that says uh, to Justin Perry, Varsity Wrestling 2005-2006, Section 7 champion at 119 pounds. The Varsity Wrestling Squad, Ty Hermes. James Billion. Andrew Mammoth. Justin Perry. Rusty Finlayson. Brandon LaValle. Nicholas Trombley. B.J. Gavin, James Shaw, Alan Lashley, Adam Manor, Cody LeClaire, Sean Daly, Joshua Trombley, T.J. Burnett, Scott Manor, Harold Parrish, <coughs> scorekeepers, Stacy Siskavich, Megan Valley, and Amanda Fillion. At this point, I'd like Mr. Jared Correa to come forward, please. Uh, for those of you who didn't figure this out, this is Mr. Ross's final season as a varsity wrestling coach. And uh, Toby and I can both agree that it's been a great pleasure to work with him uh, over the past years. Um, and we are very sad to see him go. Uh, we also understand that he will never be very far away. Um, the reason I'm back up here is um, my co-captain my senior year, uh, Trent Curry, uh, can't be here today. Um, he was our first state champ, and uh, he has a little something here from Mr. Ross. He'd like me to read it uh, and present it for him. All right. It says, uh, the end of an era. There once was a man referred to as Coach Ross, although most of us graf grapplers addressed him as the boss. He touched our hearts in many ways. We never thought we would have to witness this day. I'm not really sure where to begin. There's just so much to say. How do you thank a man who inspired us so deeply every day? We appreciate everything you've done for us, the wrestling camps and trips, the open gym, the wood stove training, the nationals, and the weaver flips. You've exemplified compassion, determination, and poise. You've taught us to be respectful and during weigh-ins to not make noise. You've instilled us with such gratitude, integrity, and pride. You've pushed us to a limit to be successful with every stride. You'll never be forgotten, boss. You are genuine and true. In two weeks, I'll be an All-American, and I credit it all to you. It's not about undefeated season, state championships, and loaning, us, loaning all of us gum. It's about the bigger picture and the successful young men we have become. We will always cherish all our life experiences we have shared with you, Coach Ross, 
And no matter where our walk through life takes us, you will always be our boss. Thanks for the memories. Train.
varsity girls with coach by Mr. Don
great basketball players? <coughs> Ryan Bushy. Alex Barron. Tyler Campbell. Nick LaValle. Shane Kleinbell. Tyler Drake. Joshua Lajway. Ben LaValle. Corey Goodrow. Nathan Siscavage. And scorekeepers Johnny Torgo and Monica McCombs. The modified basketball team. We looked pretty good. 
The 2005-2006 Bobcats showed potential throughout the season and hopefully will continue to improve the next season. Remember, guys, that you can do anything that you put your mind to. To the returning players next year, please work hard on your games over the summer. And remember that if you put your mind to it, you will succeed at anything that you do. And most importantly, don't give up on yourselves or your teammates. To the seniors, last but not least, Kyle, but coach, I want to dunk in a game, Brasser. <laughs> Stewart, the bank is always open nickels. James, the sweaty soupling. <laughs> Josh, but I love the dive drill, McNeil. And to Travis, my dog love. <laughs> guys and have you on our team. Good luck with all your future endeavors. Work hard. Good things will happen to those who work hard. Good luck guys. The boys varsity basketball team. I'm not sure I can get the meeting right. Doug Alexander. <clears throat> Benjamin Boyan. Kyle Brasser, Jesse Dubray, Derek Juber, Travis Law, Johnny Torville, Monica McCall, Varsity Boys Basketball. Would the JV and cheerleaders come forward? JV cheerleaders are coached by Mr. Carter Blue. Yes. You are a hardworking group that never gives up. 
As you move on, I know that all of you will work hard. Let your passion for cheerleading never, never let you forget what cheerleading is all about. It is about sportsmanship, good spirit, and supporting the basketball team. Competition is an extra perk. If you do well at the first three, then you have been successful. And although I know we would like to do well at competition, it, is, it does not define our accomplishments or failures. Thank you to John Rabideau and the Board of Education for giving me the opportunity to coach this squad. Thank you to the parents for all of your support during the year and for allowing me to spend quality time with your children. Thank you to Michelle and Janelle for all of your assistance and a special thank you to the girls on this team. Words cannot express how much you have given me and I hope that I have given each of you something that will always make you fondly remember your days as a Davy Shoe. J.D. Cheers, Lindsey Boris, Brooke Carter, Jill Gardner, Rochelle Harris, Caitlin Jackson, Megan Jutton, Kirsty Kelly. Tiffany LaPointe, Kelly Norman, Kelly Rock, Taylor Sample, Angelia Stavis. The JD Cheering Squad. Leaders this year were coached by Ms. Leslie LeBar and also Ms. Marie Bull. Coach 
thank all of you. I know at times we were very hard on you, and even though you may feel that we <clears throat> were too hard on you, we did want you to do your best. As a team, we may not have necessarily won what we had wanted to, but in fact, we really did. You will all be winners in my eyes because there is more to winning than just a trophy. I hope all the seniors the best of luck and much success and good luck to the returning girls next year. The girls love some cheerleading spot. Kelsey Torvald. Heather Bordeaux. Kim Matthews. Amanda Meyer. Jennifer Rock. Brittany Garrett. Christine Lutt. Justine Barkham. Amanda Bushy, Jacqueline Hardy, Aaron Hemingway, Kaylee LaValle, Stephanie O'Neill, Ashley Snow. Ashley Barber. Courtney Byler. Courtney Trudeau. Lauren Carter. And in charge of the girls' music, Amanda Toro. Girls Varsity Cheerleaders.